Hey everyone. I hope you're having a great day. Today in this very exciting tutorial, we will be learning about how to create and animate an Instagram follow pop-out effect in Premiere Pro. Let's take a look at what we are going to create. That looks super awesome right? I will be using an Instagram logo which I downloaded it from internet. Before we begin make sure to hit the subscribe button for more amazing tutorial. Without any further ado let's begin. Create a new project. I will name it as Instagram. Now import our stock video and Instagram logo to our project panel. Now drag the video to our timeline like this. We now have our video. Drag the Instagram logo above the video track on the timeline. We can start animating. Select the Instagram logo track and go to the effects and control panel. Place the time indicator at 1 second. Keyframe the size and rotation. Drag the timeline to the beginning. And change the rotation to minus 180 degree and size to 0. Highlight the last two keyframes and select ease in. If I play it, as you see, that our animation is slow and not looking good. Drag the last two keyframes little to the front and play it. That looks good. Now press the arrow key near the size. It will bring us the graph. Drag the anchor line slantly higher like this until you see that slope, like in my graph. Do the same to the rotation. Select the keyframe and drag it like this. Now if I play it, you can see. That our animation looks great. But it's a little quick. So drag the last two keyframes little further like this. Now we have that clear smooth popping out animation. Highlight the first two keyframe and select the ease out. Here we have the perfect pop out animation. We shall start adding our name. Create a new title. I will name it as follow me. You can type your name, but for this tutorial I will type add follow me. Change the color to pure white. Click OK. Now our title being created, drag the text to our timeline above the Instagram track. Drag the text little to the right using the position. Select the logo track then right click on it. Select the nest. I will name it as Insta. Make sure that your logo track is selected. We will decrease the size little because a logo looks really large and drag it a little to the left that looks good the reason we nested our logo track is so that we can decrease and increase the size without affecting our keyframes select the text and drag it little to the left also that looks good place the time indicator at the end where our logo finished popping out like this. Keyframe the position and drag the time indicator to 1 second interval. Like this. Drag the text little to the right like this. Now highlight both keyframes and right click it. Go to time interpolation and select ease in. 
Place the time indicator little further from the first position keyframe. Then keyframe the size, and change the size to 0. Drag the time indicator a little further, and change the size to 100. Highlight the size keyframes and right click on it, select ease in. We will do the same graph, that we did on our logo animation. Press the arrow icon, and select the keyframe of the size, and drag the anchor line higher. If I play it, you can see, that our text is animating. But it's taking too much time to start popping out, after our logo did. So highlight all the keyframe and drag it little to the left like this. Drag the last two keyframes little to right like this. If we play it, there we have the perfect pop out animation. That looks super good. Now select the text and logo track and right click on it then select nest. I will name it as Instagram follow. Decrease its size and place it wherever you want. I will place it over here. Play it again, and see if it looks good on that position. That looks awesome. Now cut the track, by pressing C on your keyboard, where our animation ended. And delete the extras by pressing backspace. By holding ALT, drag out Instagram track to the right like this, it will duplicate our track. Now we have two pop-up animation. Right click on the second track and select speed duration. Now this is where the magic happens. Click the reverse speed checkbox, and click OK. If I play it, you can see the magic. There are animation pop-out and pop-in. That looks super awesome. We finally created our awesome Instagram pop-out animation effect. If you have any doubts feel free to comment in the comment section. I will reply to it, as soon as I can. Hit the subscribe button for more amazing tutorials like this, and hit the like button, if you like this tutorial. Until our next tutorial stay happy. Thank you.